Hi guys, it's Don Noix. Hi guys, I'm Tom Cody to give you guys a movie review with some spaces. This is called Star Kid. This is called Star, uh, Star Kid. Uh, if you guys don't know that the kid who plays the, uh, in, in for the machine or something like that, Alien, the Star Kid, he is basically also starred in, in also Jurassic Park, also the, the, um, the first, the first film. I don't know if there's any other films that he would, uh, he'd been in this one, so I really, I really do not know. So, Star Kid, I would definitely would say, this is a movie that is, I would say, is rare, and really actually is. It doesn't really get a lot of, you know, smoking up to, basically, basically about this film or anything like that. I don't know why, because it doesn't really seem like, it doesn't really seem like it's really the general, based off that direction, you basically see some of basically, a movie just based like this, and stuff like that. And, you know, you know even though a kid, you know, who's a, who's a nerd, who likes comic books, likes, uh, likes collecting toys, likes collecting, you know, uh, all kinds, all kinds of stuff, stuff like that. He's basically kind of like a nerd kind of character because he likes that. Um, I think it's called Midnight Night or something like that. I don't know. I think it's a comic series or something like that. I don't know if that really exists or not. I really do that. No, or anything like that. So, what is the movie basis all about? So, um, the movie is basically all about this kid whose name is Spencer. His name is Spencer, and like I said before, he has a variety of different things that he likes to collect, like comic books and stuff like that. You know, especially he's one of his favorites, especially. Midnight Night, which I, which I do believe that's right, which I do believe it is, stuff like that. And basically, basically he has a kind of like a struggle, basically with him, you know, like you know how he interacts with other students and stuff based around the school, and and basically stuff. He also gets bullied in this, in this movie also well too, ends up finding finding himself in the in the wrong place at the wrong time. I would definitely would say I've been there before when I was a kid, so I, I remember that. And one thing, one thing, one thing I definitely want to say is that this movie, this movie is not really basically, basically like a very interesting movie, but it's a rare, it's a rare gem to me. I don't see really a whole lot of people really talking about this one. I'm really quite shocked and surprised just to see how the, the amount of people based on YouTube doesn't really, doesn't even know this movie exists or something like that. And so that because you know I was just browsing the movie because I wanted to watch Stargate. I wanted to watch uh, Stargate SG One. I wanted to watch that. I mean, everybody loves Stargate SG One. I've heard a lot of a lot of great things about the show, especially in the movies as well too. And I, I really want to get back and watching that. I basically watch it. But then like all of a sudden, but then like all of a sudden, even though what I was looking for, look for looking for the movie, I couldn't find it. But then I ran to Star Kid. And I was going, oh, okay, maybe I should go watch this movie. I think I've seen this movie before. I'm not really sure, not for sure. But this is basically a year a 1997 movie. The graphics of the movie doesn't look all that bad. It looks pretty good. Not not perfect or anything. Not, not, not perfect, but it definitely looks pretty good. I think this movie kind of reminds me of like a, um, basically kind of like a, a Kamen Rider and Power Rangers mixed together. That's what it kind of basically it feels to me in you know, Spencer, he ends up seeing this this uh, this robot thing or something or something like, like or the or the alien will probably call it a bio suit or something like that. It's basically it's for somebody to basically to go into into the suit and then you wear the suit and you have to learn how to control it and stuff like that and, and basically it's basically that. I don't know how they really did the acting basically in this film or anything like that. I really do not know how they really actually did it, but I'm really kinda of curious like how to get him, basically Spencer, to be in the suit and stuff like that, and you know how he did all the walk in and stuff like that, and basically it, it, this and stuff, and you know, it, 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 I would imagine basically the suit of the cell, or the bio suit, whatever you want to call it, the alien suit. I would, I would basically say, I don't know how in the world they got the kid inside the suit, or how they made or stuff like that, but it doesn't look like no CGI. Affects really all that much. Maybe just some, maybe just a little bit. When you're basically, you know, when you're basically just watching the film, and you're like, you see, you know, like shooting at each other, and you know, you know, and stuff like that, and stuff like that, and that, that looks, that looks pretty much okay. But I would definitely would say that this film, that this film to me is basically is that I could tell this movie does not really have a whole lot of budget, basically built in, in this film. Which I think that is can be a good thing, but it's not a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. That it's it's not a bad thing, and you know using using less CGI, you know especially other movies, you know what we do, what we do and how it's, it looks like it's a pretty simple movie just to base it just to make and stuff like that. But I'm really kind of curious about like how much money that they spend on they spend on base for this film. But I will definitely will say Star Kid is basically it's a rare gem. It's it's really actually yeah, it's very very rare. You, nobody doesn't even knows anything about this movie, 
or until that, that. But I would definitely will say, I'll definitely say, this is a highly recommended film. I definitely would think everybody should should go and watch and stuff like that. Now, is there a likely very good possibility if there's going to be a second movie, maybe a sequel, maybe into the future? I highly doubt it. I really don't think it's not really it's going to happen or anything like that. I just don't really don't think if they really are going to show a new film, if they really are going to show a new film, or maybe a possibly maybe a remake, maybe into the future. That's something that's something I'd like to see happen, but I'm not really sure for sure. But I do, I definitely think I'll, I definitely think maybe a remake remake would probably would be good. But I'm really kind of curious where they're going to set up based with the film also well too. Now the film does have a little bit of comedy also well too. If you guys know me, I'm not the biggest fan of comedy. The comedy was quite was quite soft in this movie. What I mean by it is that it was not heavily it's not heavily out really all that much like people would basically see it. But yeah. If I have to give this movie a review, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. I think it's a really good movie. It's not a perfect movie, but it's a really good movie. But I definitely do think it does deserve a lot of respect, basically, basically, basically who, you know, people that made this movie. And I definitely would definitely would say it's, 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 it really actually is. And, you know, a lot of people, a lot of people will probably would not, will, will probably just drop this movie off and just say, you know, they're not going to watch or until that. But like I said before, like I said before, it's highly recommended. It's a 9 out of 10 to me. I would definitely go and watch this movie. If you guys get bored of that, you gotta watch this movie. It's really is good. It's really good. But I guess for nine out of ten, so that's my opinion on something that. I love him. Would you guys have to say about the movie? Do you guys agree with you guys or agree with it? Have you guys seen the movie? What is your thoughts and things? So stuff based on the movie like all the So yeah. And it was just none of us. It was us against there. Take care. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe. Please consider subscribing. Uh, please hit the like button, give me a thumbs up, and please hit the notification bell also well, too, so let me know you guys watch my uh, watch my, watch my reviews, and we're, we're live right. So yeah, like so far, love you guys. Take care. Hope you have a fun day. Take care. God bless. Love you guys. Please stay safe. Amen. Stay blessed. Love you guys. Take care.